Hello everybody, my name is Kids Coding and welcome back to another video. So today is essentially going to be the fifth day. Like I said, it's day five. And day five is something really, really important. But it's not really that important. It's just extremely short. It's just a short lesson about something called icons. Icons are like extremely simple. And like, it's not even that complex. And there aren't like many different ways you can do it. There's only like one way you can make an icon. Um, so um, the first thing that we need to do to make an icon is that we first have to go back into the CDN right here and we need to add this link. The reason why is because whenever we do the icon, we're unable to like get them like we're not we're not able to like get them from like the code itself like the browser isn't able to like display it from the code so we have to use a um, website online that will get us the image. And if we don't um, reference that website, then the browser won't know where to get the image. So we need to reference that. I have it right here. I'll put it down in the link in the description below. You can go down there and check it out so that you can copy and paste it. It should go right after link, but it's essentially going to refer to that link. Okay, so now we're at the website. So what you can do down here is that here are all the different types of icons you can choose from. There are several different types. So you can just go ahead and pick a couple. I'm just gonna do one for this demonstration. I'm gonna do, uh, I'll do bank. So the way to do that is I take that back whatever I said before. There's two ways you can do it. They're both kind of really similar. So first we need a body like always. After that, we need a container class. For that, we can do two things. First thing, we can use fan class, the same way how we did the badges in my previous video on day four. Um, and then the other way is we can use I for icons, but um, you, I prefer using I, but I'm gonna show you both. And then to do an icon, we need to do fast, and then a space, and then fast and then whatever the icon name you want. I'm going to do bank. And then we just simply end it there like that. And then we go ahead and save it. Let's go back here and then if you load it, let me go back. Okay, I think I need to do an I, but let's see if an I works. No, it okay. doesn't. So let me do a different icon. I think I think that's why it was. Yeah, it was because of the icon. So um, don't change anything you put. That don't um, don't do bank. I think I gotta do. I think whatever's in the parentheses of Elias is like. I don't think you can do it. So if something has a in parentheses of Elias, so like auto mobile, automobile, whatever you guys call that, and I do it. Nothing's gonna happen. So I think I don't think you can use the icons that have like an Elias in parentheses, but um you can use the ones that don't have that. So like you can use all these. You can't use this one if it has an Elias. That just has something to do with Google itself. So I'm just gonna do a back right here, and then it's gonna go ahead and save it in the middle. So you see, it, is, it shows the bath icon. You can also do it with the span, like this. And it's still gonna do the same thing. So those are the two different ways you can do an icon. If it has an Elias in parentheses, please make sure not to use it. Otherwise, nothing's gonna show up and you're gonna be confused like what happened. So yeah, make remember that it has something to do with the icon. So you're gonna have to choose a different icon that doesn't have this. So like choose one of these. So that's pretty much it with this video. It's really really simple and short on how to do icons. It's a little bit different in Bootstrap, especially because I'm doing the most recent version, which is Bootstrap 4. All these videos are going to be on Bootstrap 4, not the third one. So yeah. So if you enjoyed it, be sure to go down there and hit the subscribe, follow my Insta, Kids Clinic Club, if you're interested. And that's pretty much it. I'll just wrap this video up again, and I'll see y'all next time.